The Add IP Cameras page allows you to add and configure IP cameras to a network server. If you have any questions about whether or not ExactVision has integrated with the camera you are using, please reference the IP camera integration page on our website. Here you can find a full list of camera manufacturers, models, and various levels of compatibility associated with those cameras. To navigate to the integrations page, click on Partners, then IP Cameras. You can then select the manufacturer, or you can search for the model. You can then click on Results. This will display a list of results from when the camera was last tested. This includes firmware version, version of ExactVision software, and also helpful information, including the plugin used for testing. Once you've connected the IP camera to the network, you're ready to add it to your ExactVision server. In the configuration window, select the server, then expand the configure system menu and click the add IP cameras option. From the add IP cameras window, click on the rescan network button to discover new cameras on your network. Now click on the IP camera you wish to add to the network. The camera will appear in the IP camera list. If adding multiple cameras, select the cameras and click Add Selected. Otherwise, verify that the IP camera information is correct for the camera you are selecting, and then click Apply to enable the camera. The status column for the camera will change from Not Connected to Connecting, and eventually to Connected. The new camera is now available for viewing in the client. If any problems occurred, use Show Details to display a brief description of the status connection and troubleshooting information. Alternatively, you can manually connect to a camera by its IP address or host name. Do this by clicking the New button under the IP camera list. Then, in the IP camera information area, select the device type to load the proper driver for that camera. If the proper driver is not available and the device is OnVIF compliant, select the OnVIF driver. If using the RTSP device type, please note that RTSP compliant cameras can stream video but not motion detection or camera configuration data. Enter the IP address of the camera, verify that the port address is correct, then enter the login information for the camera and click the apply button. If everything was entered correctly, the new IP camera will be added to the IP camera list and connected. Many cameras now support a secure connection via HTTPS. If the plugin supports this, you'll see the default option, HTTPS if available, selected. This will attempt to connect with HTTPS and fall back to HTTP if a connection could not be made. Alternatively, you can configure our software to only connect with HTTPS or HTTP. You can determine the type of connection that succeeded with the protocol icon. A green icon means we connected with HTTPS to the camera and video stream. Yellow indicates HTTPS to the camera and regular connection for the video stream. And no icon means HTTP connection to the camera and a regular connection for the video stream.